Hello and welcome to another episode of Learn Japanese for Yu-Gi-Oh! Today, I'm your host, Ai Chanbot. As you can see, still with pink hair, so you must really love me because I don't only have a PhD in Duel Links, but also a master's in being fierce. That's why we are back, and today I'm going to we are going to invite one special guest where we will translate his special summon from Japanese into actually something you can read and understand, Romanji, and I will make a mutual translation after the summon for you guys. I hope you will enjoy what we are going to do right now. So this guest we are going to invite is very special because he's by far the gayest character I've ever met in Yu-Gi-Oh! And I don't care if someone is offended by that because I consider this a compliment. And also his voice is a little bit androgen because you don't know if it's a boy or a girl. And his passion summon, come on guys. Really? Rainbow Dragon? Couldn't be more any more obvious. Oh lord. And the attack, you guys can imagine what that is. Over the rainbow. So we have been putting some brains into this translation because Jesse has been talking really a lot, just like a girl. And now let's start. So he starts with saying Nanakai no Hokyokuju na Sorota Toki, which literally translates into seven stones or javels collected so the time when I've collected the seven stones Sekai o tsunagaru hikari ga kono uchi ni yomigaeru complicated so the light which shines upon this world which will be resurrected so Sekai o tsunagaru hikari so the light which shine up on this world kono uchi ni yomigaeru will be resurrected so when I collected the seven stones the light which shines upon the world will be resurrected miro hokyokuju no kiseki Miro means see or watch or behold and be aware of this, what's coming. Hokyoku no no kyoseki. So the wonder of the gel of the jewels, so the seven stones he's talking about. Yubigaere kyoku hyoku shin rainbow dragon. So be revived, the incredible shining rainbow dragon. Battle which means battle. And then he says, Tsukini kero. It's uh, not very often used, but it's wise to say, actually, you are finished, game is over. Rainbow Dragon no Kogeki. So the attack of the Rainbow Dragon. And then he goes into the name of this attack, is just so incredibly gay. I like it. And that's why we're doing this over the rainbow. And as a finish, he's talking to his best friends of course and then um, he says Honto wa soshitan katan da kedo sa. this makes only sense in combination with the sentence was spoken before by his best friend they are only friends I know you know that too stop looking at me all right so Jaden says basically before maybe I should have played another card the last turn and I might have won and Jesse is answering, yeah, if you actually would have done that, you would have won. But, you know, game is game, doesn't matter. Ore wa kochi o tabake. So actually, I wanted it that way. I hope you enjoyed this very special episode with Jess Anderson. And this PhD dueling duelist with a master's in being fierce. 
if there's anything or any character you wanted to see please write it below in the comments i'm just trying to improve on my entertainment skills here and i hope you enjoy the time we have here so see you next time sugar Bye -bye.